on your right. Clear. Car right. Right side's clear. How's it going, everyone? Always OG here, and today I'm bringing you something a little bit new. Green, uh, green, green. I have kind of an intro, but not really. 20 minutes remaining. You've got 20 minutes left. Yeah. Martin, this is the race. Uh, this is going to be a GT3 race at Spa. Uh, I believe I did this last week or the week before, something like that. Either way, we're starting 18th. Um, I didn't do any practice, didn't do any qualifying. We're at Spa. And we're just having fun. The goal of this race was, was SRA, originally. I say originally because you'll, you'll see. But uh, we did get ahead of one. We have a little bit of a knock-on effect here, which... It kind of sucked, but it didn't really affect anything that much. I haven't actually done a post-race well commentary in a while. And this is just... Uh, also sprung on because I got a new microphone. Well, it's not really a new one, but it's a replacement microphone for my Astro A40s. Regardless. With lap one is pretty standard for a lap one. We are definitely giving a bit of space to Alex in front of us. Lap one is usually something that you don't really want to go super crazy on. I feel like that's a pretty obvious one. But for those of you who are really, I guess, into sim racing or in racing in general, uh, there's a common phrase. Race is not won on lap one. For some people it is, but for most it's not. Car right. We do have a little go. He's still there. With Alex here. Still there. We are going to let off the gas just a I'll little bit. Right. He is going to give us a little bit of room and he's going to run himself wide, but we definitely gave him as much room as we could. And there we go. We survived lap one here at Spa. This is the new Porsche 911 GT3. Or it's a 992 or something like that. I can't remember, honestly. There's, I'm sorry, there's so many Porsches. I do love how this thing sounds, though. In game and out of game, it is pretty great to hear. Car in front of us is Rowden. Here we have a pretty decent uh, example of good versus bad positioning. The BMW in front of us decides to brake a couple a couple times before uh, a reach for some reason, which then gives us a really Still poor there. exit out of Radion on this last straight Still here. I can't right. remember what the straight, or Camel, I think it is, yeah. Camel straight was uh, not great for us. We did block off Alexander what behind us, but as we're about to find out, poor positioning leads us to lose technically, car left. well, I, I say effectively, three positions. Still there. We lost the position to the Ferrari, we lost position to the pink BMW because we should have passed him, and then we obviously lost the position behind to the other BMW. So, not a great lap, too. But that's alright. Getting an off-track that off also track doesn't limits, really help out that much. <laughs> and, uh, as you can see, the 5 out of 17, SR basically went out the window in my mind at this point already. I didn't even notice where the, the first 4X came from. I didn't we missed it. We we also missed just completely getting destroyed there. And we missed getting destroyed again. A lot of times we should have died this, this uh, race. You think it might be Colado. But basically, we got Alexander out. I mean, we didn't do it, but he just kind of did it. Okay, there. We're going to fast forward just a little bit. We're going to do that a couple more times out this video, so it's just you know, in the interest of time. But we are going to see a little bit of okay, fighting. Wallace. In front like of us here. Out of that. And this is going to be the, I think, third or fourth time where we almost died. You see the rear view mirror. He's just completely been it. Might be Clear left. And we get by Ben again. And we stay by him. 
which is gonna be good. Now we can catch up to this Ferrari and Porsche pair, which we just conveniently, with the magic of editing, catch up to again at the end of lap three. They were making a few mistakes, they were fighting a bit, and uh, this was the fun part of the whole exchange with everyone here. We do have Ben still behind us, pretty close, so he is still technically a threat. But we do have the Ferrari and the Porsche in front of us, kind of fighting to the point where uh, they're really losing some tents here. But we are side by side with the Ferrari going into Ogres, which is not a good thing. Two by... Well, too wide, basically, going into Ogres is not fun. Someone is going to get an off-track. Someone right. is probably going to get a slowdown. Right. In the case of the Ferrari, he right got a slowdown. And we get by the Porsche just because he had a pretty bad line. And I did kind of set myself up to get around both of them on the Camel Straight again. So we do get around everyone there. We make it up to P9. We fast forward a couple more laps and we catch up to 8th and 7th. They're not super close right now, but uh, they were before this. Uh, there was a bit of an incident with Brian here in front of us. And they were fighting quite a bit, and they were going to the final chicane, and he did not basically break uh, in time. But well, we are coming up to basically the last two laps here. And I don't normally overtake into this final chicane, but um, Brian just kind of left the door open. He did break a little bit early, Still but there. I also... I needed a new pair of underwear after this Still one. Still there. Because, uh, I was slammed on the Come brakes. On, Wallace. Good stuff. Keep it coming. Use all the track. Boss, hit we did the get gap. the move done, though. He's faster than you. Entering the Fania P8. And he did give us enough room. We did give him enough room. It could have been a lot worse, but thankfully it was not. And there we are. Up to P8. We started 18th. We are now 8th. It's not the greatest of runs, some people would say, but uh, I'm still new to this. I'm still within my, my first couple years, so you know what? I'm going to take this. And this was like a 1500 burger lobby or something like that, which I'm, I'm on my my rise. White flag. I'm getting back up there. The Mason in front of us does break here just a little bit early, and he was a bit indecisive. Trying to figure out if he wanted to go down the inside or not, but uh, he decided against it. Which then gives him a really bad exit at a turn one. An incident in Rouge. Which then Looks gives like us a really Radion. good one for Rouge and Radion. And we're just going to go ahead an and stay Looks like Alia. with this final lap. Okay, well, we have been cutting got 10 minutes of fuel and and whatnot around, but uh, yeah, we'll keep up with this one. We have to do a smidge of defending. On the camera straight. Uh, I did break maybe a little bit early there, but uh, it was a trying to compensate for being in the middle of the track. Mason did almost go into the behind, or the behind of us, the back of us, but uh, he did not, thankfully. Always got to be patient around this corner here. A lot of people get on the the throttle a bit early. You're spinning like three quarters of the way through the turn. And we come down to what I am trying to remember is Puan, I think. I hit that inside curb a lot, and if you do that, it bounces you and throws you completely to the opposite side of the track. Easy to get an off track that way, easy to get into the Astro Turf or whatever the green is basically out there. And you lose a little bit of grip, but not a whole, whole lot. This final section of Spa, I, I'm not a huge fan of it, but it is, it is fun. I will give it that. I just have a lot of uh, a lot of places to go off track, a lot of places to spin out, especially for me, and it just was not all super fun, but you know, it is what it is. As we come into the final chicane here, let's see if Mason does a dive or anything like that. We do get out of the way, but uh, we get the car slowed down just in time. 
Good win, Josh, man. Everyone congratulating each other. Four. Super wholesome race, this one. And there we go. It, 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 we finished seventh. Started 18th. Yeah, Bring home seventh. We got good Thank points. You, and still positive. And that's that right. collision at the end. Kind of had 